I'm going to share something with you. That might put me in a very negative light, yeah. Relationships are not my forte. You see if someone grabbed up my wife and saying, completely different ball game. I'll walk away from it and this has been like a therapy session. Razabani for IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast, Ricky Hatton. How was that? Talk to me. Let's go to the ring walk because that gave me goosebumps and brought, brought me down back to memory lane. No, oh, it was brilliant. It was brilliant. Um, yeah, the crowd, you know, the roar of the crowd, Blue Moon. Just when the minute I, I just come out of the tunnel and started making me... Uh, Make me entrance, do you know what I mean? Before, before they even announced my name, they just a roar of the crowd. And walking from the changing rooms here to the, to the arena, it was just, I could just hear it getting louder and it was just brought up so many good memories back. You get into the ring, uh, we know it was going to be uh, an exhibition fight, we know you weren't going to go all out, but you seem quite content with the pace and, and you, you kept throwing that jab, you kept moving your feet. How did you actually, how did your body I felt, react? It felt great, I mean, I love to watch it on the. Um, on the TV, but I mean, me, me gas, me gas felt, um, me gas felt great. Do you know what I mean? I, uh, I think when I, um, I think when it, when it, I think I could have, up, I could have upped it more if I'd have wanted to. I, I think because me gas was great in the corner, I was having conversation with Blaine, my trainer, and everything. And um, but I thought, I thought the pace I set and the thing was just enough. You know what I mean? Because it is an exhibition, and at the end of the day, but. Um, You've been watching me for years, you could see me in the corner, just nothing, nothing. So I think um, if it hadn't been an exhibition, I'd have put my foot down, but it was an exhibition. So I think what me and Marco did was just perfect. There were times where you landed clean on him, there were times where he landed the overhand left on you, and yeah, it seemed like you were talking to each other to say, whoa. No, not, not at all, not at all. He hit me with um, a swing, a big long left left hand, and it cracked me, and it was quite a good one. And then he backed off for... Um, for a good 30 seconds, you know, but I mean, it was like, there was no, there was like really no need of, you know, but, um, no, it was, uh, it was, it was, it was great to be honest, of course, it was shot. I mean, normally when I get close, normally it's bump, bang, 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 but it, you weren't one of them fights, was it? So. You said you wanted a, a fairy tale ending, you wanted your, your parents here, your family, your friends, your brother, your, your grandchildren here, uh, how did it, how does this feel now, now that you've done it? It was great, you know what I mean. I got everything I wanted out of it and more. Yeah, it was um, yeah, really, you know, the the build up, what it's done for me physically and mentally, and then to hear the roar of the crowd again and share the ring with a legend like Marco. I mean, um, you know, when people say these exhibitions, oh, they're a waste of time and that. How can it be a waste of time? Look what's happened to Ricky Atten. Do you know what I mean? You know, I've inspired people out there with mental health and weight problems and this and that. And I've shared a ring and did an entertaining, you know, night with, with showcasing our skills again. How can you say that? It was a waste of time, you know what I mean? Having accomplished all of that, is, is Ricky Hatton now content? Yeah, I think I'm content now. Yeah, I think... Uh, I mean, if another one comes, because it's been so good for my well-being, I'll look at it, but I think pretty much, yeah, I've... Um, yeah, you know, I, 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 yeah, I was happy with tonight, to be honest, and if that is my last dance, that, that'll be good enough for me. So Fran and Floyd Mayweather's talked about doing an exhibition in the UK, but I'm guessing he'll be the absolute perfect dance partner for an exhibition. I suppose so, yeah. You know, if I decide to do one, I don't know whether I want to do it. I mean, the, I did this for, um, you know, because I'd lost family from mental health. I've lost loved ones from mental health. Lost loved ones through the COVID. So I wanted to come and put on a bit of a celebration, if you like, you know, um, to, you know to get the people just, you know, to as a pick-me-up, you know what I mean, for people, which uh, I think I've done that, I've inspired people with mental health, I've inspired people with the weight problems that have said, wow, how's he done it, you know what I mean? So I've, I've ticked all the boxes, so um, if I don't do another one, that'll be good enough for me. I know you're in the gym anyway, you, you train many fighters and, and many other individuals, but do you want to make sure that you, you stay in, in decent shape and, and not, you know, yeah, add too much weight? it's change for me, now this is the, the, the stay Ricky Atten. Final message to the fans, to your adoring fans that turned out and, and, and rolled back the years. No, just thank you for coming, you know what I mean? I, uh, I appreciate that it's, uh, you know what I mean? It's an uh, expensive time for living in it, for petrol and lighting and electricity and all the, the things that go with it. And we're four weeks away from Christmas. And um, I think everyone's struggling business-wise and crowd-wise and concert-wise and stuff like that. So 
you know, bearing that in mind, and we're four weeks away from Christmas, I think that was sensational from the fans again, and I hope they enjoyed it. Ricky, from myself and everybody, thank you so much for the for the great memories and and long may it continue. Cheers, Ricky Hatton for IFL TV, thank you very much. Relationships are not my forte. Eh? See if someone grabbed up my wife and saying, "Please, different ball game." I'll walk away from it, and this has been like a therapy session.